And I told you I was going to put up a video on harmony. Now, here with me is God Gift. And today, we're going to tell you about harmony. So, I'm going to start with the definition of harmony. I'm going to make this real fast, okay? So, what is harmony? Harmony is, you know, singing uh, two or more notes, entirely different notes at the same time, forming what we call chords. They move uniformly. And form beauty of sound okay and by demonstrating you will understand it better so there are three um, arrangements of parts okay and I'm gonna demonstrate all of them right now the first one you know we have four parts okay we have soprano we have the alto we have the tenor and then we have the bass I'm gonna leave the bass out for today okay so we work on three parts three arrangements first the soprano is the highest part and then we have immediately below alto, always below the soprano's alto. And then we have below the alto tenor. All right, that's the first one. Then the second one, what if when the soprano is in the middle, then tenor is at the top, and that will be high tenor. And then below will be alto, okay? Soprano, alto, tenor. The third one, the soprano has come down now, okay? So we have soprano on top of the soprano tenor, and on top of the tenor, we have alto, okay? So I'm going to demonstrate to make you see how it sounds when um, maybe soprano is at the top, middle, at the bottom. Depending on the song, some songs you may have the melody. Sometimes the uh, sopranos take the melody. You have the melody slow, sometimes it's high, okay? So it depends on the song. The, those are the three arrangements of parts. Now, let me tell you how to find your parts. Yeah, three tips, three, okay? You find the melody first. What's the melody? You know, you're walking on the street and a song pops to your head. Happy birthday to you. You're singing the melody. All right? No harmony. So, that's the melody. So, two, the second tip is to pick a reference note. Okay? As a beginner, you may need to pick a reference note. All right? I know some people, they've really advanced. And when they hear it, they just come in. But as a beginner, you need a reference note. For instance, um, let's give a short example. Bless the Lord, bless. So you take bless as a reference note. So that's the melody, soprano, bless. All right? So say, bless, bless. Then below, remember it's auto. Bless, bless. Let's go. Let's say to the same time, one to go. Bless. Do you see that? We sang two different notes at the same time forming harmony. Okay, so you pick a reference note and usually pick the first note as the reference. So when we say, bless the Lord, don't pick maybe uh, the Lord, just pick the first one or the most outstanding notes. Okay, now the third one, run the scale. Okay, the scale is like you start with the melody, let's say the melody is at the top. There's a scale, and I'm, perhaps I'm going to do a third video to run through the scales from key to key so I can exercise it and, you know, put it right here in your memory bank so that when you hear a reference note, when you pick a reference note, you can just run the scale and get the three notes, okay? For instance, we have um, this. Um, as the soprano, okay? So when we go... Um, these are the three parts. Ah, so it's a bless the Lord. The other one. Ah, bless the Lord. Alto. And then we have tenor. Bless the Lord. So ah, I use bless as my reference note. Bless, bless, bless. I replace the as with the bless. You understand, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So when we move to maybe another key, say this one, F. Bless the Lord. Now I pick bless as my reference note, right? Run the scale now. Remember, three steps. First, the melody. Bless the Lord. That's the soprano, the melody, okay? 
Then pick a reference note. So what's our reference note? Bless. Bless. Just one note. Bless. So now that's step two. Step three. Run the scale. Bless. 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 All right. Yeah. So let's go again. Do the soprano. Bless. And I'll do the alto. Yeah. Okay. Bless. Okay. Bless. Let's go. One to go. Bless. Then one about ten. Bless. 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 Do the soprano again. Bless. All right. So now we're gonna do a full song. This one is called "Great is the Lord and Greatly to be great Praised." So when you find um, the first notes, you know it takes practice. You know you have to listen a lot to people who can do it very well on radio, TV, and I advise you to use a headphone because when you use headphone, you can hear sometimes the parts separated. Okay, you get to listen to it, and sometimes you find a tenor singing here, and uh, you you'll be able to distinguish the parts. But when you listen to it on the speaker, everything comes to you like that. Okay. Uh, so headphone is better if you want to hear the parts. Okay, so we're now gonna do a full song. Great is the Lord, you know the song, yeah? yeah. So we've now done just the first note, so we're gonna go through the whole chorus, okay? So how do I determine where the parts go? Like I said, practice. Sometimes you have to ask questions, sometimes you have to listen, but practice and you're gonna get there, okay? So great is the Lord on key C. So key C, what's key C? So first of all, I'm going to do alto. Mm -hmm. Three steps. Great is the Lord. Right? So, reference note. Great. great. Run the scale. Great, great, great. I want to do alto. So immediately below the soprano is alto. Great, great. Okay? So that's my first note. Now I'm going to run it through with you. Great, you. Mm -hmm. Great. <clears throat> Are you ready? Yep. I'm going to do a bit of an advanced harmony okay so sometimes you find the auto going like this but i'm going to explain later great is the lord and greatly to be praised in the city of our god in the mountain of his holiness beautiful for situation the joy of the So that's the alto. Let's try tenor. Let me do the okay. low tenor. So we have great, great, great. Yeah, that's my tenor. Great. So you sing the same thing. Great, great. Are you ready? One, two, three, go. Great is the Lord and greatly to be praised in the city of my God, in the mountain of His holiness. Beautiful for situation, the joy of the whole world is Mount Zion, the size of the northern city of the great king. Is Mount Zion, the size of the northern city of the great king. Great. How great is the Lord. Great. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's try something a bit more complex okay. you know like we have the low tenor we can also have a high tenor mm -hmm. high tenor means the high extension you know you hear about octaves all right so we have when we have uh, great. the high one will be great low one great okay so we're gonna do the same song again and you this time i'm gonna sing the melody okay okay and you're gonna sing the high tenor right okay but we're gonna do it on a key g so you sing tenor. So now, mine is great, great, great. Yeah? <coughs> so the same running scale, you know, you run it up this time. Great. My key, my part is great, great, great. But you, you're the second one because tenor comes immediately awesome. above. The soprano. So I go great. Remember yours? What's yours? Great. great. All right, one, two, go. Great is the Lord and 
greatly to be praised in the city of our God, in the mountain of His holiness. Beautiful for situation, the joy of the whole earth. It's Mount Zion, the size of the northern city of the great King. It's Mount Zion, the size of the northern city of the great King. Great. Now, there we go again. Great is the Lord great. <laughs> okay, now we're going to, I'm going to do the high tenor. Woo! No, high alto. You just did a high tenor. Yeah, yeah, so I'm yeah. going to go uh -huh. one above you. Okay. 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 Great. So, it's so great, great, great. Yeah, so you're going to okay. do great, great. I'm going to great. Are you ready? Great. <clears throat> great. One, two, go. Great is the Lord and greatly to be praised in the city of our God. In the mountain of His holiness, beautiful for situation, the joy of the whole earth is Mount Zion, size of the north, the city of the great King. Is Mount Zion, size of the north, the city of the great King. That's it. Wow. <laughs> so that's where we stop for now, okay? Watch out for more videos later. See you later. Bye. Bye.